Hi there, Internet. This is Paste. I am Garrett. I'm Annie. And uh, we're here to talk about uh, Super Nintendo World. Yeah. Uh, what, what is uh, It's a new theme park thing, right? Yeah, it's uh, coming in July, maybe? Sometime in the summer of 2020. This summer. Yeah. It's, before uh, the Olympics. Before the Olympics in Japan. So, so basically, it's being built at Universal Studios theme parks around the world. It's going to debut at uh, Universal Studios Japan, which is in Osaka. And the goal is to get it open before the Olympics start, which uh, they start in Tokyo in July. So they're just saying summer 2020. So we don't have a firm date yet, but it's looking like it'll probably be June or so. Maybe they probably don't July. have a firm date yet either, which uh, is why we don't, but... Yeah. It's a theme park. It's coming. It's going to happen. Okay. So, you know, I've written some about it. I know you've you've boned up a little bit on the, on the subject. What I watched you, the video with Charlie XCX. What do you think of that video? It's pretty uh, fun looking. Yeah, it looks fun. You learn nothing. But it's mm. a nice song, nice video. Um, yeah. It's all like conceptual, you know? Like yeah. the video doesn't really show anything that actually exists. But it sort of tries, it tries to give you an impression of what it might feel like to visit Super Nintendo World whenever it actually exists. Yeah, it kind of feels like you are just inside a game with all of your favorite Nintendo characters. Hang yeah. out with Daisy, hang out with Mario. Right. Ride Yoshi. Yeah, it's all uh it's looking like it's all going to be Mario themed, at least the original the, the development of it, the first part of Super Nintendo World. Um so like this first uh expansion in Japan, it's going to be in the Mushroom Kingdom and you know, they'll have question blocks everywhere and you know, the Green Hills and all that stuff. Not the Green Hill Zone, that's Sonic. We're talking about Mario and Nintendo right here. Uh, going to be a couple of rides. Um, I just nodded as if I knew what you were talking about. Yeah, I, I just sort of go off and don't even know what I'm saying when I'm in front of a camera like this. But so, you know, it's Nintendo. It's going to be a couple of rides, uh, one based on Super Mario Kart. Yes. Another based on Yoshi. Uh, what, what, what are you what are you looking forward to with those two? Mm, I think I don't know. I think it's just the, the cool idea of just putting yourself in the game. I played Mario Kart this weekend. Still mm. a lot of fun. Yeah. Holds up. Were you playing the, uh, the one on the Switch? Yes, it was the one on the Switch, yeah. and it was the drinking version where you oh, yeah. drink a beer while you play, but you can't drink and drive. Right. Does that make sense? Yeah. Yeah. You can probably do a version of that. I mean, Universal, they actually sell alcohol at their parks. Oh, so, yes, 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 I mean, yes, you can't do. take it on a ride. You can't be going around the Mario Kart course while drinking a beer, but you can have one before and after if you'd like. Um, but the ride, yeah, it's going to have, I think, up to a dozen different scenes based on different Mario Kart tracks. And supposedly, these, this is more rumor than fact right now, but there are going to be two lanes sim like side by side so that like you feel like you're actually racing other guests. Occasionally, they'll have like dummy carts come by that have audio animatronics of characters from the game. So, you know, maybe Bowser will come up alongside you and then like a turtle shell will take him out. Could or you something. imagine driving and you just look to your right and Bowser? Is just there. I would love that. Would what, you be intimidated? No, I would want to give him a high five. He'd probably be like a Morton Joe in that Mad Max movie and just like give us a withering glance and tell us how mediocre we are. Um, yeah. Or what if it was the, uh, you know, what's that guy? The Luigi with the mm, death yeah, stare. Yeah, that was the actual Luigi. Yeah, the Luigi, the guy, you know, the, the character? Luigi. Yeah, from uh, the Mario <laughs> games. Uh, he had that death <laughs> stare in the uh, that the Mario Kart there, the one you were playing. He kind of just gives you like this, you know, like anyway. Uh, yeah, so the other ride is going to be in that, that Super Mario Kart ride, actually, based on what, you know, we've seen, what sort of like patents have been filed and stuff. It looks like it could be like a really cool state of the art, like first of its kind type of attraction, which something like Super Nintendo World deserves that yeah. sort of innovation. Just as long as you can wear the little mushroom hat that's all i care about surely that's yeah. gonna be a thing oh and there might be there are rumors there could be an augmented reality aspect to it where you wear um visors and uh you know you see what's around you but then like they superimpose say like the weapons from the game so it looks like you can actually like hit the question mark and get like a you know a, a turtle shell or a banana peel or whatever Again, that's just conjecture based on patents that have been filed and it's not actually released uh, confirmed news yeah, yet. Yeah, basically what we're saying is there's nothing about this game that we know other than yeah. the video with Charlie XCX and what you can just guess yeah. by all of the different clues here and there. It is kind of Mario-esque in the way that they're rolling it out. Yeah. And there's like a two second clip of the, the Mario Kart vehicle in that uh, XCX, Charlie XCX ad. So yeah. yeah, everything is all a guess pretty much at this point. And it's not just gonna be the one park. There's several. 
Oh yeah, no, well, it's going to be uh, they're going to be opening up at Universal Studios around the world. Um, currently, all four that exist, we know it'll be opening in Singapore. Um, which yeah, go to Singapore to go ride Mario. Uh, also, uh, Universal Studios Hollywood in California and Universal Studios Orlando, mm -hmm. where it's actually going to be uh, part of a new theme park that was officially announced since I wrote my article. But uh, they're opening a new theme park called Epic Universe, uh, Universal Studios Orlando, and uh, Nintendo is going to be part of it. Cool. But uh, because it takes so long to build a theme park, it may not be open until 2023 or 2024. Basically, America is going to be like probably the last to get these rides, it seems. At least Orlando will be. I mean, it makes sense, though, that we're not the first yeah. because it's Nintendo and Japan. So yeah. I'm OK with that yeah. and wait. Mario rides normally, you know, take a while to make it to American shores after they debut in Japan. So this is just the way uh, things have always gone in the world of Mario. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, there's also a second ride that's going to be a part of it. At least some of what? them. There may not be a second ride in all the parks, but there's a second ride that will be in Japan and most likely Orlando uh, based on Yoshi. Where oh, cool. You get to ride inside of a Yoshi. Inside of a Yoshi. Yeah. Okay. Like he swallows you up with that tongue and mm -hmm. you just hang yeah, out yeah, in his yeah. belly. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. And apparently it's like a, it's a small world ride, but with like Mario people. So you go through this little fascinating and beautiful tableau full of audio animatronics of Goombas and Koopas and whatnot. Sounds fun to me. What Mario game character would you most want to see uh, realized in the real world within a front of your eyes? Ooh, anything from the water worlds. Oh, the like, little fish. Yeah. Um, the fish and the jellyfish. Um, that expand into multiple mm -hmm. jellyfish. I would be excited about that. Um, or those, I, what do they call them? The bloobers, like the octopi? Mm -hmm, that like mm -hmm. sort of like, yep, yep, yeah. yep. Um, I would be excited about um, Birdo. Oh, yeah. Yeah. I'm into Birdo. She throws eggs from her mouth. Right. Um, and Daisy. I would be excited to see. I would think because of Mario Kart, Daisy would make an appearance there. She's probably there. But it would like, be cool if she had her own thing. Yeah. I feel like she's always overshadowed by Peach. If they ever have like a tennis court, she could probably be, you know. She's good at tennis. Is she Peach's partner? She can be. Yeah. I guess it doesn't matter. Anyone could be anyone's partner. I don't know. Oh. Also, uh, hey, you know those wands they have at the, the Harry Potter land? Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. So they're going to have a sort of interactive element like that uh, at Nintendo World. It's For those be... of you that don't know, at Harry Potter World land. Wizarding World of Harry Wizarding Potter. Wizarding World of Harry Potter. You can go into Ollivander's yeah. wand shop. Good job. And um, a wand chooses you just as it does in the movies and yeah. the books. And the video games and all of the other Harry Potter properties. Yeah, all the other yeah. sort of paraphernalia. You can walk around with that wand and you can make magical things happen in the, uh, you know, the, the, the storefront windows of the Wizarding World. They're going to go for something kind of like that uh, in Super Nintendo World with what they call the power up wristband. Uh, which you wear on your wrist. And that way, when you walk beneath a question mark block, you can sort of like do that, like Mario, like jump up the, thing the jump. and hit cool. it and it'll read your wristband and supposedly give you some coins. I don't know what you're going to do with these fake computer coins in the real world, but maybe it'll also say your name. Maybe. Maybe. Like the ET ride used to yeah. do that. When it it's like, <laughs> and you can barely understand what Goodbye. it's saying. Goodbye. Yeah. <laughs> ET still does that. He's, uh, he's still talking. I didn't know that ride still existed. It still exists. And cool. if they ever get rid of it, that'll be a sad day for America. Um, yeah, so Nintendo, uh, Super Nintendo World uh, coming to Japan in the summer and then around the world uh, slowly thereafter over the next few years. When we have more info, uh, we will probably share it with you in some capacity. We'll try. Yeah. Uh, thanks for watching and have a good day.